Hello there guys, welcome back to another short online tutorial based in Photoshop with myself Jack, one of the tutors at Blue Sky Graphics. And of course, yet again, it's my absolute pleasure to welcome you here today. The reason why we're here today guys is to discuss the difference between image size and canvas size, okay? There are two different methods to change the size of your document, okay, within Photoshop, uh, which is called image size or canvas size. Now, it can be a little bit confusing, um, and that's obviously why I'm here today to clear things up and make it a little bit more clearer for you. Okay, so what I'm going to do now with my layer highlighted is go to image. Okay, and as you can see here, we have image size and canvas size. So the first one we're going to talk about is image size. Now, when we're in image size, okay, we will be directly changing the amount of pixels within our image. So if we was to increase the number here, we'll be increasing the number of pixels within inside our image. And obviously, if we were to reduce the numbers, we'll be reducing the number of pixels within inside our image. Okay. Just be conscious if you were to increase the number of pixels, you may get a blurry sort of pixelated feel. So be very, very conscious of that. Okay. And then we have, go back to image, canvas size. Now within canvas size, it's a way of increasing or decreasing the size of, a, of an existing image without stretching it or transforming it. Instead, it creates empty space, additional pixels around the outside of your image. So if I now was to increase this, let's say to 55 and we'll say this to, let's say 32. Okay. And as you can see, it has created additional pixels around the outside of my image here. So basically when we're manipulating the canvas size, you're essentially changing the background size. The image within your document is not affected or transformed at all. Okay, guys. And that is the difference between image and canvas size. Get to know it. And hopefully now it's a lot more clearer in the head for you to continue on with your fantastic design. If you're interested in finding out more about uh, our school, our teachers and what we have to offer, please give our website a visit at, at www.blueskygraphics.co.uk. Also, what you can do is have a look at some of our amazing work by our amazing students on our Instagram page at Blue Sky Graphics UK. Guys, thank you very much. Take care and I'll see you next time.